All right, we are back now with a Hollywood legend. Kevin Costner has starred in so many iconic films, from Field of Dreams, proving if you build it, they will come. Mm. Two Dances with Wolves, which earned seven Academy Awards, including Best Picture and Best Director for Kevin. Well, now his latest endeavor is Horizon, an American saga. It's a four-part film about pioneers settling in the West. Uh, a dangerous time when you never knew who you might meet man along the way. Everyone in that house, he might as well have been walking up to get the mail for all that bothered him. Now they had a second loss and they're this much farther out of their way. Can't imagine it'll be any kinder to you this time. So they'll just kill me then? Right out in front of everyone? No, they'll probably take you somewhere quiet, won't they? Mm. Mm. <laughs> Kevin, good morning. Good Thanks morning. for being here. Yeah, that's kind of a severe way. Mm. Of, it's our Shakespeare. Yeah. You know, he didn't have to go out and say it. Mm. He just... Let you fill in the blanks. Yeah, I mean, this is truly, in every sense of the word, an epic that that needs to be seen on a on a big screen. You conjured this up in 1988. Thought about this. You you put your own money into it. You co-wrote it. You directed it. Um, what has this journey been like? Getting this finally Ooh. to the big screen. It's it's it's, it's really been a, a. It's not the first time for me. There's a. A lot of the films I like, uh, whether it be Field of Dreams or Bull Durham, they were very tough to get made, too. Yeah. It's just, it's like, well, you know, um, minor league baseball, uh, voices in a field. They're, they're, you, know, uh, you know, I did a movie called Black and White, about my version of racism, and I couldn't get anybody to do it, so I put up the $6 million to do it. So I, I think I am probably the only person I know that pays to work. Uh, you know, but I, I don't think what I like is that far off what other people do. But if someone says you can't do it, then that's a I, I can't just uh, somehow turn my back on what it is I dream about. Mm -hmm. I can't I can't legitimize a, a, a voice that makes no sense to me, mm -hmm. you know, and so. And That's your, a, your family man, I was reading this morning, I thought it was pretty nice. Like, as a director, um, you're open to having people on the set. Like, I read, you know, from actors' parents, maybe your own dog, or, you know, why is it important? I can imagine some people would say no, you know, push everybody out. Yeah. Why let people kind of come in? Well, listen, you can you can really scare people off by, like, ooh, it's voodoo, he's a genius, he's a thing, he's been a curtain, and you go, like, yeah. you know, it's like, no, there's, there's actors out here that have parents that want to see them. So yeah. if they want to come see you, come watch the monitor with me. Sit in the Seat. I don't care. But it is a workstation for me, so just r r kind of keep it down. Sure. But if I, I don't close things off to people. I don't like throwing up a wall around my good luck. Mm. Yeah. One thing I also saw, you guys filmed or tried to film in some pretty crazy Always. weather. Yeah, no. Right? I mean, yeah. Did that help get everybody into like the feel of what it was like? We had then? we we were holding on to everything that was wow. storms. I, I'm making a, a six hour go figure. <laughs> Uh, I'm making a one-hour document. No, I'm not. Just say it. it's the truth. I'm make, making a six-hour documentary about uh, what it took to make this. Wow. You know that that uh, you know, and so you know, when you think about Oscars or you think about anything for a second, you know, sometimes I think the Oscars. Well, what are they really about? Mm -hmm. And I think to myself, it's like, you know, it's when when someone watches it, should be either about like, oh, I'm going to go see some movies that I never saw, or. I'm going to make movies. Mm. I'm going to do this as a business. You know, I have a lot of passion for it. I understand what it can do, what it can mean. And when movies are at their very best, they can be about moments we'll never, ever forget. You know, it's uh, we want people to watch the movie, so we don't want to give away too much. But one of the things that, that I enjoy is in this particular Western, Western, you include lots of different voices mm. that, that aren't usually featured in Westerns. We'll just leave it at that so folks can watch it. But I do want to ask you about Father's Day. Mm. How was it? How, what'd you do? I celebrated on Saturday because I knew it was <laughs> flying to New York on <laughs> Sunday. But uh, no, I was with with the kids and then the, got up early in the morning because I knew I was going to fly. So does anybody want to go swimming? Oh. And everybody came out. We were in the pool. So um, it's just being together. It was a, it was a good moment. Uh, and then I kissed them all and and came to New York. Yeah, I know you've you, you've you've got grandkids. I just finally had my first. What is it? What is it so special Ooh. about a grandfather on Father's Day? I think watching how your children are mothers and fathers. Mm. You're watching the grandchildren, but you're really watching how your children are uh, taking care of them. Mm -hmm. Can you relate? 
Uh, I can now. <laughs> I can now. That was great. Yeah. That was great. Kevin, thank you so much. Thank you so much for that being here. Good. You're welcome. That's right. And Horizon, an American saga, chapter one in theaters, June 28th, chapter two out in August. Good stuff. Chapter right. three? What's chapter three? I've started to film it uh, already, so I don't know when, what date will perk it. But, you know, one of the weird things that came out of making this was I, I'm going to have my gunfights, but women dominate Horizon. Hmm. And if you see it, you'll realize that, that there was no West without women. Hmm. And their voices are... That's why I took yeah. them all to con yeah, with me. Yeah, you brought them all out there, right? Yeah, because the, what they, how they highlight this show. So I, I do hope you get out of the sun, hmm. get into someplace shady yeah. and dark and cool, and go West. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.